Ghoulish Gabs, thank you for joining me to riff the Mad Doctor. The prequel to The Good Doctor. I am a surgeon! Ha ha! Pluto, get on top of that doghouse and write about this dark and stormy night. Nice storm, ASMR. No wonder they're sleeping so soundly. The lightning flash turns on a TV to the Twilight Zone. This, as you may recognize, is a Mickey Mouse cartoon, no longer under copyright, waiting for you. Oh, the big bad wolf has been practicing. Well, being the only doctor in town has driven Dr. Wade over the edge. Good thing the doctor walked through wet paint. How else can we get Scooby-Doo shenanigans? Castle Grayskull? Better call He-Mouse and the Mousters of the Universe. Dr. Triple X? Did Ralph Bakshi direct this? Nah, in old cartoons, Triple X means booze. It's a speakeasy. Oh, he's in Super Mario World. I bet he wishes he got the cape instead of the fire flower now. I don't think they're going to let us in, R2. Ugh, you got bored by Jacob Marley! Oh, it's a trap set by the Looney Tunes. You don't see a lot of pull string operated security systems. Be our guest. Ugh, cheap Ooh. 3D gimmicks. The Mad Doctor is renting a timeshare from Snow White's stepmother. Still less animal cruelty than we've seen from Mickey himself. Oh my god, he's wandered into a Windows 95 screensaver! <laughs> oh, now you're stealing Goofy's yell, Mickey. <laughs> Better falling down the stairs shot than Psycho. Oh, that room was way too hard to animate. This looks easier. These twins are still less bloodthirsty than the Army Hammer Winklevoss twins. Oh, it was just harmless shadow puppets. Maybe those silhouettes can do the riffing now. Oh, hey, what's going on? Uh oh. Come on, I've riffed that already. Oh, Mickey's about to do the time warp. The Mickey Horror Picture Show. Geppetto made this one during a dark period. Come on, buddy, there's no smoking here. Nobody tell Walt. Man, the skeletons get rambunctious between dances. Mickey should know better than to stand near bricks that are clearly cells and not background. Hey, stop climbing on our bunk bed. Oh, these are better sleeping conditions than a travel lodge. Eh, Mitch Hedberg was wrong. Escalator temporarily not stairs. Oh, this was what Trump saw on TV. Sid Haig? Well, Rob Zombie's Mickey is at least as good as Rob Zombie's Monsters. No. This is what anti-vaxxers think Pfizer is doing. I'm a roaring, telling wizard. Wait a minute, are you a wizard or a doctor? Maybe he's Doctor Strange. <laughs> I can graft a chicken's gizzard on the wishbone of a pup. Okay, but the internal heart transplant is way more impressive. Here's the great experiment. If you're into weird crossbreeding impregnation, you could have just become a Sonic the Hedgehog fan artist. I doubt if the net result will bark or grow or cackle. Playing God just to find out what sound the hypothetical animal would make? We found a dog napper that makes Corolla's goals seem pragmatic. The chicken dog says, Oh my God, kill me, please! <laughs> ah, that's what happens when you climb a ladder from Wacko's bag. Uh, please, sir, we just met. This is way too early for you to move into my rib cage. It could be his head wasn't screwed on just right. Mickey, wait until the elevator unloads before getting on. It is the Tower of Terror. Ah, it's the Harlem Ghost Trotters. The first cartoon depiction of eating ass. Dr. Triple X, it's filthy. Hey, how are ya? Great to meet ya. We get so few visitors. Ah, ah, ow, road. Is this the new Widow's Maze at Scary Farm? I don't know, I'm not in that one. Why does the spider only have six legs? I don't know, why does it have bones? Why the William Tell Overture? Still less bloodthirsty than the Army Hammer, Lone Ranger. Okay, ghosts can be defeated by fire, skeletons can be defeated by tickling. You can learn so much from cartoons. Okay, I definitely fought that in one of those Hobbit video games. Yeah, but it's no silly little guy. 
How is the shadow gonna help crossbreed the vocal cords? Wow, Peter Pan's shadow got off easy. Man, King's Quest II gets really tedious after a while. Oh, let me in! I have a check from Publishers Clearing Mouse! Maybe he just needs to speak friend and enter. It was a push. I feel silly now. Make Veil vale School for the Gifted. Power releases, all right. Why is there a bat signal aimed at him? I don't believe that man's ever been to medical school. This cutscene's taking forever. I just want to play Epic Mickey. You gotta do more sterilization than that. Maybe these are real desperate conditions for surgery, like on MASH. Like on Monster MASH. Oh. I deserve that. Time for your prostate exam, Mickey. I want to buzz saw, Louie. Oh, I wish my stomach had teeth so I could eat the buzz saw. <laughs> That's what the movie Teeth was about. It was all a dream? Disney's been trying to own Wizard of Oz since before it came out. This is for all the garlic spray at Disney World. <laughs> Why does Mickey wear more clothes to bed than outside? Well, hopefully this dream teaches him to secure the doghouse better. Pluto's actually having a dream that Mickey's head is an ice cream sandwich. Oh, sure. You don't give me a part in this one, but I'll hold the egg card for you, dear. <laughs> well, that was Mickey Mouse the Mad Doctor. Not to be confused with Superman the Mad Scientist. Although that cartoony vulture sidekick wouldn't have been out of place here, I would like to thank my dear friend Ghoulish Gabs for riffing the short with me. I mean, I guess I could thank her in person because she's my roommate, but eh, she's at work right now. I'll thank her when she gets home. And you should subscribe to her channel if you haven't already. She has some fun dives into Disneyland attractions you know and love, and even some attractions you might not know. And maybe some you didn't particularly love, but her dives are fun. Of course, I'd also like to thank my patrons for their continued financial support. You can become a patron on Patreon the place for patrons. But if you want to keep up with what I'm doing for free, don't forget you can also subscribe to my email newsletter, The Doggins Digest. I'll let you know what I've been up to every week or so. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm off to go mix a turtle and a badger just to determine what sound it'll make. So until next time, this is Dave, signing off. <laughs>